guys. Quick tutorial today on the clench anchor strap. We've been getting a handful of questions on it. So I'm going to walk you through the basics really quickly here. So you have the long portion of the tube. That is designed for the bands to hang on. Short portion of the tube. That's what pinches in the door. When you go to put it in the door, make sure that you are on the side of the door that's opposite the hinges where you can see the frame. Throw your band anchor over the door. Close it. Pull it tight. The tube catches. And when you pull, it should be closing the door into the frame, not trying to pull the door open away from the frame. You need to shorten it up. Just like this, grab the short tube, slide it down to the end. You can tie a knot in at any length that you want. Just a, a simple loop knot. Right around like that. Slide the short tube right back up to the top and you're gonna pinch that into the door. Just like that, you got a short anchor strap, and of course you can adjust the length weight based on where the knot is. Knot will not be too terribly difficult to undo. Just like that, it's back open. You can also use the underside of the door, if the gap is tight enough, this gap is not tight enough, the strap will pull through. You can also use the hinge seam. I like to put it right here, underneath the hinge, the low point, so that when you pull up, it gets caught in the hinge and it won't slide up on you. The other awesome way you can use the clench anchor strap is in a post configuration. So if you have a squat rack, if you have a deck post that's outside, if you wanna hook it to a tree, if you wanna hook it to some playground equipment, all you have to do is loop it around just like you would loop uh, the resistance band. Simple slip knot configuration, and it'll create a great anchor point for where to put your bands. So that's a quick and dirty summary on how to use the clench anchor strap.